Hey guys, it's Decoran here. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to move your Dropbox installation from one drive to another drive. That is right. If you guys do not know, I have a Dropbox app that I recently got from my reaction channel. Of course, when I react to footage, I have up to five to two to three to maybe in seven gigabytes of footage that I just place on that Dropbox application. Now, I didn't realize it defaulted to my actual C drive, which is only a 500 gigabyte hard drive. So right now I only have less than 100, not 100, 200 gigs to actually work with. So we need to move that to my other hard drive that is four terabytes. That way I actually have a lot more space free on my C drive and just my E drive can take care of it because I don't really have to be concerned about it right there because I'll have a bunch of space extra. So that's what I'm gonna do here today and teach you guys how to do it for yourself as well. So let's get right into it. Okay, the first thing I want you to do is go to your bar down here and just type up dropbox because what i've noticed sometimes is if you don't type it up it won't instantly pop up for you to actually just mess around with the files now that it actually pops up like see you can see here's the footage and stuff like that we were just going to fold that down and then go on to the little icon here and go on to the dropbox icon which you can see right there so we're just going to click on this and it's actually going to show everything in here in our dropbox and we want to click on our user and after we go to our user we want to just go down the preferences once we're in preferences you're going to see of access to a few things but the big thing we want to keep an eye on is sync so we're going to go to our sync area and you're going to see this one little area says dropbox folder location choose where your dropbox is located on this pc you can see that's my c drive and my c drive is actually only at 200 gigabytes actually no i only have 121 gigs left free but my actual hard drive has way more than enough space free so we need to move this so what we're going to do is now click move and when we move it, we're just going to click on this PC. When we click on this PC, we're going to click on our hard drive. And then we're just going to select OK. And are you sure you want to move this? We're going to say yes, that's fine. Then we're going to apply. And then, oh, it's going to start applying. OK, there we go. So what's going to happen now is that it's going to take everything that was in your Dropbox already and move it all over to your other drive that you want to place it in. For me, you can see like it's moving over to my E drive, which is my four terabytes. That way it actually moves it and I have free up the space on my C drive because I do not want my C drive being taken up. So now we're just going to let this run. Okay, you see now it's finally finished and we can tell because it says E drive instead of my C drive. And now what should happen here if I actually click on my PC, this PC on this, it should automatically update this from having 121 free to being higher than that so we refresh now now i have two gigabytes free of actual space which is very good and of course moved over to my e drive so that is how you move your dropbox application from one drive to another if you guys did find this video helpful though make sure to smash the like button if you want to do me a favor get subscribed because we're trying to hit a thousand subscribers before the end of the year which would be very much appreciated but until then i'll see you guys for another tech video tech grant out